Hi, I'm Lauren from LSP Actions. Welcome to this brief tutorial showing you the LSP Pastel Snow Globe digital backgrounds for Photoshop. You have five snow globes included in your download, all Photoshop files. You have Winter, Peach, Lola, Candy, and Sage. They are all really, really pretty, beautiful, light, pastel toned snow globe digital backgrounds. And the great thing about these is they are so, so easy to use. Once you've downloaded, double click to open up into your Photoshop. Make sure you can see your layers panel. If you can't see it, hit window, make sure you've chosen layers. And you'll notice in your layers panel, you have your background. You have a placeholder layer, this is orange, it's just a blank layer, it just means if you click this one, when you add your subject image in, it's going to be in the right place. You have a shadows layer, you have the globe topper, don't turn this one off. You have the reflections in the globe, and you have some snow. You can play with these if you want to, so make sure you've clicked the orange layer. And then all you need to do is drag and drop your image, or come up to file, and choose place embedded. Either way is fine. I'm just going to drag an image in. I've got beautiful images here sent in from our photographers this year. Which one shall we go for? I think it's beautiful shot here by Lucy Peak Photography because the colours are just going to blend so beautifully well. So you can see you drop it in and it's in the snow globe. So all you need to do is resize, alter if you want to, and hit enter. Now this one is a portrait image so you can see we have some sides here. All you need to do is come down to the bottom the little rectangle with a circle in, add a layer mask, grab a brush, set to black, make sure your brush is soft, nice and large. My, my brush does look a little bigger than it is on my recording uh, video screen recording software. I'm just lightly, very, very lightly dabbing that in. I'm also going to go up onto the snow layer and with the black brush just take a little off the face. And we're done. You see we have reflections on top here. I'd leave them in place, but you can mask if you wanted to a little bit. And that's literally it. It is that quick and simple to use. And at this stage, to save it for your client, you just come up to File, Save as a Copy, and choose JPEG. If you want to save for web, um, for posting on socials, you can still just save your copy. But I prefer to go to Export, Save for Web, and save a version there. It compresses it nicely for saving um, sharing online. You can create as many as you want with these. Even if you've just done one and saved it, you could drag another image in and just do the same thing and just resize. If you need to add a mask to brush the sides, you can do. If your image is portrait, you won't need to do that. And there we go. And you can go ahead and save that one as well. Let's grab another one up. We have pastel candy, you get five in the collection. And let's find a beautiful image that's going to work with pastel candy. Any images would work. I prefer lighter images for these ones. You can get darker snow globes on the LSP Actions website. Um, which one should we go for? How about this beautiful one here by Elena Cold? Again, it's just in. All you need to do is resize. And you're done. And you can go ahead and save that for your customers. You can make as many of these as you want to. You can just make them over and over again. Gorgeous one here by Henrietta Gomez Photography. Really lovely and you can see all the reflections are done for you, adding that beautiful snow globe 3D element. Let's do another one. You can see how quick these are to do. We've been here a few minutes and we've done several already and that's talking through them. Beautiful image here by Kat at Dinky Dots Photography. And just getting in. And just save it. And you're done. Pastel Peach. I really love the colours in this one. Let's find a beautiful image to pop into Pastel Peach. Oh, I need to bring that down. So if, you, if it comes in at the wrong place, just drag the layer and just drag it down to the right place. I'm just adding a little bit of masking there. Done. Beautiful. 
this beautiful shot here by Magda Bright. Let's do this one. This one's cute. It's a little one. Let's drag one in. Another one here from Lucy P. We'll just resize that in place and done. And then just save it. Literally, it's that quick and easy. You can just create as many of these as you want to. Drag your image in. Resize. If you need to make any editing, that's cool. Just go ahead and do that. And then save. And you're done. So I hope you love these. You can also watch the tutorials on the LSP Actions website. You can watch tutorials for the Santa snow globes and snow globe original pack one, which has darker snow globes in it. I hope you love these. Please do share what you do on the LSP Actions Facebook group because I'd really love to see them. I'm Lauren. Thanks for watching.